I chose Citizenship Academy because I really wanted to take control of my students' education. Like I feel like in Syracuse City, they just separate you by zip codes and wherever you live, you have to go there. Like, so I looked it up online, like I saw math, technology, like everything that I like. And I was like, okay, this is my choice. Like I feel like I'm in control and this is what I want for him. I know some schools, they don't push the kids as much as that school pushed them. And I, I was shocked when I see some question like that. I mean, I took those in the sixth grade, not in a, in a kindergarten, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I, I said, if she actually can understand those things, she's good. The, the teacher here, they working hard to improve that kid, just to know everything before he gets to the first grade or maybe to the high school. Like when he gets to the high school, maybe he, he will know everything. <laughs> Another thing I like is that in the kindergarten level, they start preparing them for further education, whether it's college or trade. I have friends whose children go to other schools, um, not putting any other schools down. Um, but I'll give you an example. When Ayana entered into kindergarten, I had another friend whose kids were going into kindergarten as well. Ayana came out reading, they didn't. Ayana came into the program being challenged with spelling tests. Um, basically, the expectations were high for them. The challenges were there, whereas the children going to other schools weren't. And that's what's important because we need to show the children what success leads to, what being academically prepared leads to, um, and the different things that are available to make sure, ensure that you're academically prepared to be successful adults.